What's the crack, lads and ladies around the world? My name is Evie Geek, and this is Metroid Fusion. This is the final part of our Metroid Fusion journey. Because today, today we beat the game. It's gonna happen. We gonna beat it. And after this, it is time to play the highly anticipated, the world-renowned sequel known as Metroid Dread. So let us conclude our journey, lads and ladies. If you're excited, smash that like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel if you're brand new. And as always, if you want to say hi YouTube, like this amazing bunch of lads and ladies in the chat right now, then head over to twitch.tv forward slash dbgeek. Anyway, trying to think where I'm supposed to go here. Um. Right, let's have a look here. One second, chat. One second. Right, if I go... Yeah, this way. Get away from me! Right, so... If we go... Oh, here. How do we... What? Wait. What the hell? What is this? Wait, what? What was that? And why is that here? I'll figure this out. Don't you worry, chat. There's something... There's something strange in the neighborhood. What? What is this? What is this? I need to figure this out. I really want to figure this out now. Blink, 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 blink. <laughs> what is this? There's something here, isn't there? I think we have to use. Bet we have to use this enemy for something. Oh shit! Oh shit! What? What? Oh god. Do I use him? Ah! What the freak? What is this? Dickhead. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Some... Oh! What? The door's open! Okay, all of that was for an upgrade. All right, then. Okie dokie. Right, hang on. Oh, okay. Aha! <laughs> Oh yeah, Mario time, Metroid time. All right, this is where we're supposed to go. I think. Oh yeah, we can open the door. Let's go. Progression is being made. Oh yeah. <laughs> yep, this works. This totally works. This is unreal. Okay, uh, uh, there we go. I, I, I burnt my legs a little bit, but I'm, I'm all good. Look at this. This is amazing. Woohoohoo! Right, let's see. Let's go this way. Oh. It's all lava. Oh. Oh, I can take the lava now. Oh, grand! Oh! Oh, wished! Okay. No, just wanted to get that, get rid of that grey area on the map. Oh, lads. Look at all this. Oh, shit. Oh. 
All right, hang on a minute. We're going to go into the navigation room, right? Samus, we're done here. Leave the rest to the Federation. We should be preparing evacuate evacuate the station the station. Can't speak. <laughs> are you joking? Do they know how dangerous the X are? How quickly they reproduce? The Federation has taken an interest in the X and the SAX. They believe this life form has endless potential applications. This is ridiculous! The X are heartless abominations! What potential could they have? It is not necessary that you understand such matters. The Federation is coming now. You should just leave quietly. This is madness. They won't stand a chance here. The station will devour them. What could be worth the risk? Capturing the SAX, of course. Are you serious? Do they really think they can succeed? It will certainly be difficult. They don't expect your help. They knew you would try to destroy the SAX. That's why they stopped sending you support data. The plasma beam modification was ready some time ago, but they withheld it to keep you from engaging the SAX. Yet somehow you restore that function on your own. They also tried to withhold the diffusion missile upgrade because they didn't want you to grow too powerful. But they had already sent it and you tracked it down. Bravo, Samus. They must, they must cancel this mission. Open a channel. I won't let this happen. They are already on their way. Fools! Damn fools! As soon as the Federation ships land, the X will overwhelm them and absorb the knowledge and power of their occupants. The X are just waiting for the hunt to begin. And then they'll spread across the universe. Galactic civilization will end. Actually, I think this is probably Sam speaking. <laughs> the X hunger uh, for form, knowledge, and power. They mimic these perfectly, but they, they cannot copy the soul. They're single-minded and in instinctively seeking the increase in number. They're a plague, and the Federation underestimates their threat. The X must not leave here. I must destroy them all before the Federation arrives. This station has a self-destruct mechanism. I must use it to destroy the X here and on the planet. I must send them to oblivion. The station and myself if I have to. Oh, what? No way, dude. Oh, I can't go that way. Wait, what? Open the hatch. I have been ordered to confine you until the ships arrive. Don't let them do this. Can't you see what will happen? Adam? Uh, uh, Adam? Who, who is Adam? Friend of mine. And what would this friend advise you to do now? He would know... But the only way to end this is to start the self-destruct cycle. He'd know how important it is. Did this Adam care for you? Would he sit in a safe command room and order you to die? He would understand that some must live and some must die. Oh my god! He knew what it meant. He made that sacrifice once. So, he chose life for you. Our fair warrior, Samus Aran. Your Adam gave his life so that you might keep yours. For the sake of the universe? How foolish. How dare you! How could you hope to understand, machine? You know that detonating this station in high orbit would not guarantee the complete extinction of the X parasites even though the station would be utterly destroyed. You would only succeed in removing the one obstacle to the galaxy's ruin yourself. You would ignore this simple fact and choose death. When Adam decided who would live, he chose incorrectly. If you were to alter the station's orbit, then you might be able to include the planet in the vaporization field of the self-destruct detonation. What? You would have to start the propul propulsion sequence now before the Federation arrives. Oh my god, it is Adam, isn't it? This is Adam! This is Adam's subconsciousness! Samus, this is your last mission. Go to the operations room and adjust the station's orbit path to intercept. <gasps> it's Adam! SR388! 
then return to your ship and escape. Move quickly and stay alive. That's an order. She knew it! She knew all along! Any objections, lady? <gasps> there it is! Oh, oh my god, this is legendary! Wah! Yeah, I'll go save the universe. Just gotta check this room here first, though. Oh, I can't go back. Fuck it. Never mind. We need to get over there. So, let's move this way. Wait, what? Ah, lads. <laughs> what is this? Wait, wait, wait. How do I... Excuse me? Well, that was an interesting one. Up we get! Up we get! Oh, oh man! Oh, we're so close. Oh! Oh! Oh, it's a showdown! Oh, we're show We're throwing down, boys and girls! Take this! Come on, let's go. Let's go fake Samus. Oh, <laughs> she's really strong. <laughs> let's throw down. Oh my god, so strong! Oh my god! So powerful! Ah! Oh my god! So strong! Alright, so this is gonna take a little bit of skill, lads. I'm not really sure how to what what way to the fight the fighter. Whoa! This is so tough. Holy shit, dude! What the freak? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. How am I supposed to beat her? Oh, dude! <laughs> Can't get me. I'm up here and you can't reach me. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Never mind. Oh my god. What the freak? <laughs> really, they ran it. Just be this now. <laughs> Don't catch me. I'm better at this than you are. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no. I feel like I need to lose her somehow. I'm not really sure how. Oh my god, she takes so much health off though. What? <laughs> Give me away, dickhead. Oh my god, stop. 
jumping near me. Ah! She always gets a shot in before I even get a chance. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Get fuck off! Oh my god, she's like in my face! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! What the freak? Whoa. Oh my god! What is that? Okay. This work is crazy. I don't know what to do here or how to beat this. What the freak is that? What is it doing? Oh my god, will you just fire the damn thing? Oh god. Oh god. Oh. No, no. No, oh, give me the health. Give me the health. Give me the health. How did, did I beat it? What the hell? Oh my god. Give me the health. Give me the health. Give me the health. Oh my god. Give me the health. Oh my god. No! I've only got one health! No! Oh, God! Ah, lads, one health! Literally one. Alright, at least I know how to beat this guy now. No, this is not good! This is not a good attempt! Ah! So annoying when he chases me all around the place. Oh, man. Come on, dude. This is a bad attempt, dude. Oh, this is terrible. This is cruel on your thumb. Alright. Okay, this is where um, I got feck all health now again. Oh, come on. Piss off. Oh, got it. Yeah! Okay, here we go. Oh, my God. Why do I always mess that up, dude? Come on. Let's do it. Did I get it? I got it. I got it. No, where'd he go? Dude, I did it! Propulsion sequence activated. Destination, planet SR388. Oh, I gotta go back to my ship, don't I? Squasher, put in me, Squasher, quick! Thank you. I hope there's no animals that I need to save. I want to save the animals. If there's animals to save. Where's my ship? Two minutes to destination. Where's... Where's my ship? <laughs> S 
so me ship was eaten by this giant behemoth of a creature. I guess it's I guess it's not over yet. Oh shit. Oh. What? What the? What? I'm back, baby! Let's go! Why did it help? How do I? Yeah, I did that! Straight in the belly, yeah! Come on! Come on! Want some more? Yeah! Come on! Yeah, dig it up! Yeah! I can't believe the SAX helped me! There's my ship! There's my ship! Ah, my ship! Come here, ship! Come here! Beat me up! Yes! <laughs> Let's go! That perfect military mind, the wisdom of Adam Malkovich, continued to serve even after death. Until today, I had no idea that the minds of leaders and scientists were frequently uploaded to computers. My incredible reunion with Adam may have saved the universe. But how will the beings of the universe view our resolve? I doubt they will understand what we did, the danger we barely averted. They will hold tribunals and investigations. They will hold us responsible. Adam understood this, and he spoke to me in my anger. Do not worry. One of them will understand. One of them must. I've reflected upon his words, and I see the wisdom in them. We are all bound by our experiences. They are the limits of our consciousness. But in the end, the human soul will ever reach for the truth. This is what Adam taught me. Just one detail still bothers me. This ship can only be started manually. Yet before I faced the Omega Metroid, the ship moved on its own guided by someone's hands. Is it possible? Adam? Lady. What's troubling you? No way! Adam's the AI now! You wonder how I started the ship? Just think about it. They lent me a hand. The animals! Lads and ladies around the world, we beat Metroid Fusion! Yes! We beat it! I'm so glad I saved them. <laughs> I'm so glad I saved them in Super Metroid, lads. Because now they saved me. They returned to favor. I really enjoy this one. I think this one... I think I've had the most fun with this particular game um, for my entire Metroid journey so far. Um, I think it's because I finally understood what it means to play a game quite like this one. Um, I think going into it first, I was very um, naive with how the game works and the gameplay, and it, it caused lots of frustration and, you know, confusion and discombobulation and all that stuff. But that's the whole purpose of it. But the more I play through these games, the more I understand it, and the more I love it. And this experience was my favorite because... 
I've put everything that I've learned in the previous games into this one, and... Wow. Whoa, look at the suit, dude! How did we do? How did we do? Clear time, 4 hours... 24? Your rate for collecting items is 41%. See you next mission. I, I'm alright. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Alright, lads. So, that is going to be it for our Metroid Fusion journey. Uh, we have completed the Metroid Fusion successfully, and I'm very, very happy about that. Like, I really, really am. And uh, now, now we're going to be we're going to be diving into Metroid Dread. We have other M to to watch or not to watch to play as well. And then, of course, we have the Prime trilogy to check out um, in the new year. So, a lot of Metroid content still very much available to us, and I'm really excited about it. Like, I really, really am. But uh, in the meantime, lads, we're going to be checking out some stuff that I think is um, appropriate for for this particular stream. Um, so if you still still want some entertainment, lads, don't go anywhere, especially if it's Metroid that you're looking for, because it is definitely on the way. What we have here is the Chozo, and wow, look at this detail. It's incredible. Um, and they seem to have just landed here, and they're... Going to, like, study the species or something. I don't know what they're doing. Well, they're up to something. This this old Chozo here seems to have, like, an, like an egg or something. Or that's just his belly. I'm not sure. Um, we have worker Chozos here. I think they're all, like, super intelligent life forms anyway. Um, and there's a lot of them coming down. So let's move on then to the next image. Right, so it looks like here they're extracting... What, I, what I'm assuming is Parasite X. It is really, really interesting here. And they're, like, studying it, I think. And we go over here, then. We can see... Look at these... Machines. Oh, it looks like they're trying to... They're fighting a fight here, but they're also still... Like, studying these creatures. Weird. Right, so this is Parasite X. And it's after mutating these creatures. And I think the Chozo have to fight them. Now, this one's probably one of the most interesting ones. Check this out. So it looks like they've created the Metroids. Now, there's another Parasite X up here as well. Look at that. But it looks like they've created... Look at that detail. Holy shit. Looks like they've created a Metroid. You know, look, there's other Metroids in the back. I didn't even notice that. Look. Whoa. Look at their... It's almost as if it's Egyptian. I love that. Look at this image here. This is crazy. Whoa. So the Metroids were created to take over these creatures that have been obviously succumbed to Parasite X. And it looks like they're celebrating. It looks like it's working. Look at their armor. Look. Whoa. So similar. To Samus's armor. Look at that. You can actually see the Metroid absorbing Parasite X. Look at that. Look, it's almost as if, look, we're safe now. We have the Metroids to protect us. <gasps> oh, that's why JJ took a liking to us. Oh, man, I love this. Look at the tech. It's like Stark tech. Look at my boy here with the shield over here. Over here, look. Look at this dude. What a beast! Look at that. Whoa, dude. That is nuts. Look at this. Whoa, look at the size. It's almost as if these two are going to give their lives to save their leaders. Whoa. Oh, look. So whoever this is has arrived... And they're they're almost they're like so glad to see him, or her. They're like, oh, you've come to save us, blah blah blah. And then we have this image here. Oh, 
Holy shit, I didn't even notice that. Did he? This guy's evil. He just killed them. I didn't even notice that. He killed them, look. They were happy to see him and then... Dead. And now he's going to take leadership. No way. Is he going to use the Metroids for evil? But lads and ladies around the world, that's going to be it. I hope you all enjoyed. Like I said, smash follow if you're brand new to the community. And if you're watching this on YouTube, hit that like, subscribe to the channel, and all that good stuff. Anyway, I'm going to end the video segment here. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy. And I'll see you dudes in my next Metroid video. See you later, dudes.